my opinion on how to lose your fear. To have a no fear lifestyle. There is many ideas on how to have a no fear lifestyle, which is like, you know, you just got to do it. You just don't think, just do. You know, you only get anxious because you're thinking about it. And it's hard when, you know, you are a thinker. You're a person who's thoughts have always been a major part of their lifestyle such as myself I am what you probably consider actually you probably wouldn't consider me thoughtful but I do think a lot and that's because I do like my time by myself and I've always enjoyed to read to write but I've always had this ability to be able to switch off my brain and do silly stuff so <laughs> Do not think, just do. And that's because when it comes down to it, I've identified something that all people have and this causes them to stop, to not think, or well, to think, and just stop them from doing their actions. And it's actually a very simple thing. It's simply that they want something. Back when I was in high school, we, I got this idea, which was basically like, I was so anxious about everything. I was very fearful that people wouldn't like me. I was fearful that I wouldn't perform best to my abilities. I was fearful that I would be a failure. And that's a very scary thought overall, like, you know, to have these things and you'd be like, <sighs> to be waking up in the morning and you have trouble breathing. Like, people live like that. And I've always tried to give advice to people like that. I've got many in my life, actually, who have a lot of anxiety. And first off, I say, get off your phones, get off your social media, get off all that, and go for a walk. And then second, I said, identify what you want. Because people, if you want things, if you want, it causes a place of anxiety. It causes a place of discontent. And, you know, having wants is a responsibility that you have to take on to be able to take small steps to achieve it. So the more wants you have, the more directions you're going to be going. So I want to be fit. I want to be healthy. Those two things are good. They work well together. So I can achieve both of those by going to the gym and eating well. And then I want to be rich. So I need to work on business and stuff like that. You know, and those take me in different directions at two paths. So the more wants you have, the more separation you'll have in the end. And that's three minutes. I'll talk to you in the next video about this.